Hello there guys and welcome back to another review and today I will be taking a look at the brand new 2019 the Safari Limited Kamarasaurus. Now Kamarasaurus, which name means chambered lizard, is a genus of sauropod that lived in the late Jurassic period 155 to 145 million years ago in what is now Western North America. Now the model that this is based on is Kamarasaurus lentus, which is the smaller species. And that was around 15 metres long, about 4 metres tall at the shoulder, and estimated at around 20 tonnes. Now there are two other species known, Camarasaurus grandus, which was, at, which was around 18 metres, and the enormous Camarasaurus supremus, which was at 23 metres long. So each species kept getting bigger. <laughs> and the model on the head has also been sculpted with what appears to be a hypothetical beak based on a specimen known as E.T., which seems to preserve soft tissue along the gum line. So that is a very interesting and a really cool detail that Doug Watson has added to this figure. Now, the original Car uh, Carnegie Camarasaurus is a cherished figure, but who knew that we needed a really good update of this guy? And this update does not disappoint. It is a fantastic rendition of the most common sauropod in the Morrison Formation, but it is always often looked over. In fact, the only documentary series that I know that actually featured Camarasaurus was when dinosaurs roamed America. But other than that, there are no other series that actually feature this guy. It's kind of disappointing because it's one of the most, uh, I said one of the most common, and it's also known from many, many spe specimens, including a beautifully preserved two-year-old uh, Camarasaurus, which shows so many details on the fossil. But yeah, I've rambled on a bit longer than I should have, so let's take a look at the figure. So let's have a look at the head sculpt. The head sculpt is really, really nice. We've got the classic Camarasaurus head. We have the ear hole, which is just there. We've got the eyes, they've been nicely done. And you can see, though it's kind of difficult to see with a paint job, but there is definitely some sort of beak on the mouth. It's kind of difficult to see, but you can see it there. We've also got the nostrils now in the correct place, which is good. So we go down the body. Got some nice detail, especially here on the neck. And one of the one of the legs here is raised up as it's walking along the open plains of the west of uh, the Morrison Formation. Some nice detail here on the side here. The large legs here. Slope down here with some nice red and maroon color stripes going down to the tail. Uh, as you can see the, the legs, we've got the large thumb claws. They've been nicely sculpted and also the back claws. There are three claws there and then the other two toes are right there. There is a cloaca, which is nice. And it says at the bottom here, Camarasaurus 2019 Safari LTD. Now the color scheme is very, very um, creative. Sort of like um, a bluish gray with some red and orange stripes along the back and a nice creamy underbelly. It's, it, while it might look odd, I think it looks really, really nice. Very, very cool. I mean, I thought, first thought it would, it was blue. I was like, oh, a blue sauropod. I don't have a blue sauropod. <laughs> but yeah, I, I really like the colour scheme. It's a very creative look for Camarasaurus. And while some people, people might think that bright colours in sauropods might not have worked, actually, they probably would have had bright colours like a lot of other dinosaurs and many modern day birds. So I'm really happy that uh, Safari added this colour scheme. It looks really, really nice, a really beautiful looking figure. And for a comparison, here we have the original Carnegie Camarasaurus. And you can see the Carnegie one is slightly bigger, but it is a little outdated now. So it's nice that we have the brand new Safari LTD one. But they do kind of like make a nice pair, but you can even see here on the head how the nostril on the Carnegie one is at the top, whereas in the Safari one it's at, it's at the bottom where it should be. But yeah, it's interesting to see these guys together. And one more thing, now we can have a snapshot of, at the moment, all of the Morrison Formation dinosaurs. Now I will leave a link in the description box to all of the 
Morrison Formation um, Safari LTD Dinosaurs, the 2017 Diplodocus, and also the 2019 Allosaurus and Stegosaurus. Um, I think it's really awesome that Safari are updating a lot of their older figures, and it seems quite a few of them are from the Morrison Formation. Uh, I'd love to see more Morrison Formation dinosaurs like Torvosaurus, Camptosaurus, Gargoyleosaurus, a new Ceratosaurus. I'd love to see all those. So, who knows what uh, Safari has in store for us for the future. While nothing for the Morris information is next year, potentially 2021. We can only hope. I hope you guys have enjoyed this review of the Safari Limited 2019 Camarasaurus. I think this is, a, this is a wonderful sauropod figure to add to your collection. It's nice and updated and it makes, I think it makes a nice comparison piece with the old Car Carnegie one. It definitely goes to show all of the research that has gone into this figure and how it compares with the older one. I'll leave a link in the description box to everything dinosaur where you can pick it up. So go and check it out. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this review. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Please take care and have a great day. Bye.